Hey, yeah, I fuck with it though. Since you trying to get a little rolling, you trying to get a little rolling. You chilling? You chilling? You trying to do it? Bet. Fuck your bands and cops, I got 80. <laughs> Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it Please none of the talks, I heard enough of it Like, what you gon' do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really about this, don't talk about it Really on the move, on the map, never slip Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it Real eyes, real lies, real lies All the time, stand on it If we said it, we don't walk around it Loose lips, ain't ships, red cup, blue strips New phone, who this? No, we don't allow it Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, came from. Alright, y'all, so the mission was successful, you feel me? He's able to get a red filter, man, instead of the black one that comes with the oil filter. Unfortunately, I mean, not the oil filter, the oil catch can. Currently trying to figure out where we're gonna mount it because, like I told y'all, the bracket does not fit on the strut tower uh, bar. We're trying to figure this out. Um, just give us one second once we figure out where we're gonna put it. And I'll keep updating y'all, but they got music playing in the back at the other shop. So copyright purposes, I can't really talk to y'all too much. All right, y'all, so my boy Manny, you know what I'm saying? Manny built, you already know how you rocking. So this oil catch can is basically like a universal kit, bro. So you kind of got to get it in where you can fit it. You feel me? So with that being said, at first we were initially gonna mount it up right here onto this bar but if we tried to put it there we ran into two issues issue number one the bracket does not line up with that joint issue number two it would not clear the hood so with that being said my boy manny was like let's go to use another company's design type that we can't say because this joint is you know sponsored but we're gonna put it right here in front of the radiator connected to the radiator and that way it'll low key be out the way and the only thing you're gonna see is that red filter popping up at you so if you do look at it that's what you'll see so we're definitely gonna go ahead and mount right there my boy Manny you know Manny built it's not on the shirt today but y'all know what it is man it's on the screen you did <laughs> Unless you talking numbers, we ain't speaking about the right things Switch up on my nigga for a figure, that's not like me Batty with a body in the lobby, she like nice things She used to know me then, she like me now, that's funny timing Eyes been on that prize, I cop that crib off for that timepiece I'm trying to see the globe and sell out shows into the flight lead They wanna ride my ties, but they ain't even ride or die, please But I've been short on time, been in the prime, I'm my prime easy I said I never changed and leveled up, I guess I lied, yeah Off that strain of potent just to feel like I'm alive, yeah Mix that with that potion just to feel like I'm that guy, yeah So know the one you talking to, you way outside your line, yeah Go against the tribe, you lose your Let me not even say this I just ran out of my patience. I just got tired of waiting and got here myself. They want me to believe in the dream that they see for themselves, but still doubt in themselves. They might as well light up the L. High top on 10 toe, drip retro. Talking major plays, hella high tech through the getro. Pin game, then petro. Just set it in the flesh hole. Send a text mail to give a wet clothes. On the vapor wave to make a drip drip with the left lobe and the left stroke. I'ma make plays, I'ma go long. Never look back so so long. Yeah. y'all so a couple of hours have passed maybe like an hour or two has passed and let me just say this is exactly why you don't put two perfectionists together okay because at the end of the day this is what happens okay we were supposed to be installing the bull boost oil performance oil catch can and we ended up 
cleaning up a lot of the wires that you guys was, would have seen at the beginning of the video and just making the engine bay look 10 times cleaner so basically you know what i'm saying bull boost they provided the oil catch can kit with the aen fittings and all that you know what i'm saying with the braided lines and whatnot but my boy manny is the one who kind of like added the manny sauce and i'm gonna let man ain't nobody can explain the manny sauce other than manny himself so i'm gonna let my boy manny explain to y'all what he did yeah man so pretty much we had two options we were running regular hose or that braided at first, I wanted to run regular hose, but they gave me that braided stuff, you know, and I think they, with the connection and the rhythm and the blue, it's clean as fuck. Yeah. So, we just found a little 90 here. Um, you're gonna see the before and after of it, and then we just, you know, put a little tape here, stuff like that. And then, um, man, we saw certain other things, like there was two crossing over here, so we just tucked them under. Still gonna have the same flow. Um, the next one is the EGR. The EGR one, I really wanna Remove it, and if it doesn't throw a check in your light, that's what we're doing. So we're gonna turn it on here in a bit, and we're gonna see what it's gonna do. Oh yeah, and my boy gets kind of like a low key cold start. You feel me? Because the car's been sitting for a little bit, so yeah. you gonna see what it sound like, you know? Yeah. But yeah, man, again. Huge shout out to my boy Manny. His IG pops up on the screen right now, man. If you guys haven't been in tune with all of the videos, my boy has done pretty much all the work that I haven't done on this car other than my boy Creed. Uh, me and my boy Creed installed the LT2 intake manifold, as you guys know. But me and my boy Manny installed the long tube headers, the spark plug wires, and the E85 flex fuel kit, as you guys would have seen in multiple videos. Um, so again, huge shout out to my boy. Make sure you guys go tap in with him on IG. Go show him some love. Obviously, you feel me? My man is a jack of all trades. Let's just walk in the shop real quick. Can't show too much crazy stuff, but we got a Z28, we got a ZL1, we got a Chevy SS, we got a Cadillac CTSV, then we got a 5.0 Mustang, we got a ZL1, we got an SS, and another SS over there. So obviously, my boy knows what he's doing with all cars, you feel me? So if you need something done, make sure you tap in with my boy. Come get it done right the first time so you don't be sitting on the side of the road with a messed up car, man. You dig what I'm saying? But with that being said, y'all, we're going to go ahead and turn on the car like my boy said. Make sure there's no code. And then if there's not, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up and we'll roll that outro. All right, y'all. So... This is the finished product. It looks way better than where it was from the start. Now, the moment of truth, we're gonna go ahead and start this joint up. It's probably gonna throw a code because we disconnected the throttle body without turning off, uh, disconnecting the battery. But we're gonna go ahead and see if this joint throws a code, man. Still got a little bit of E85 in the fuel lines, man. That's what that idling loping was. Sheesh. Five minutes later. All right, y'all. So basically, we went and we cut the car on, and we heard a leaking, you know what I'm saying? And it's coming from the AEN fittings. So my boy Manny says we're just going to swap them over real quick and see if that's the issue. We might have cross crisscross the fittings so with that being said we're gonna swap them over and then we're gonna check it again but bro it sounded like something was like hitting up against the belt i was like manny what the hell's going on is my car gonna explode oh my god i don't want to be uh stuck on the side of the road with a blow now nah, just fuck with you i didn't say none of that no. i'm just fucking with you so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna get the fittings taken care of and then we're gonna cut the car back on and see if it fixes the issue so as y'all can hear man for some odd reason, the filter is leaking and it's causing a vacuum leak. You can literally hear it in the car's idle. It's bugging, bro. Sounds like it has a cam because there's a vacuum leak. So with that being said, we're definitely going to have to just cap it off for right now. I already sent them a video. Um, we'll see what they say in the morning. But yeah, for right now, we're just going to cap it off. That way I don't have a leak and I can get home. Because now it is... Y'all can't see, but it's 11.15 right now. So we're going to go ahead and cap it off and uh, we'll go from there.